Alrighty guys, are you looking for a fun, interactive toy that you haven't seen before in the market? Well, I have the toy just for you, based out of a company in Philadelphia, here in the good old United States of America. If you're interested, please stay tuned and I'll see you guys on the other side. Deuces. Alrighty, first of all, if this is your first time watching, please go ahead, smash that subscribe button, and don't forget to hit the little bell for notifications. Also, please don't forget to give me a thumbs up whenever you get a chance. Uh, also, please feel free to follow me on my Instagram page, at Adam Your Dog Trainer, where I post pictures of my students on a daily basis. We have tons of fun. And feel free to send me an instant message anytime you want. We'll be more than happy to answer your questions directly. But so today, let's get to this new toy from the Neater Company. It is amazing. I have played with this for now about a month now, and it's held up very well. And as you see, there's treats inside that fall out, and it's pretty, pretty innovative. Um, I do like it, and let's go a little bit further into it, and I'll see you guys when we get uppy closey. Alrighty, see you over there. Kisses. Alrighty, so here we are with the neater pets. This is the little bag they gave me here. And this is one of the companies that I met at Global Pet Expo. Um, I had a good time talking with them since they are from my hometown of Pennsylvania and Philly. So this is kind of an innovative way to have a educational tool for your dog. And it also is a bit of a time waster so you can build that, you know, give the dog a little bit more of a longer lasting opportunity, I guess, to play with a toy a little bit longer. And I've noticed these, I've been playing with these for about two or three weeks now um, with my students, pretty much on a daily basis. I brought this to work with me and they all seem to love it. And I love the fact that they made their own innovative style of treats that go right in here. So let's go ahead and talk about these. These are the Neater Pet Treats uh, made with real chicken. Um, they are made in the USA. These are also grain free and gluten free. Um, as you see, they're designed to go inside this little hole here, so they sit inside there. Alrighty, let's take a look at the ingredients. The um, ingredients of this one is chicken, potato, flour, potato starch, vegetables, glycerin, you know, nothing that looks really bad, bacon flavoring. There's really nothing that looks really, really kind of over the top here. They kind of kept it pretty simple, pretty easy. All right, so let's dive into these. And as you see, I've actually gone through most of this bag. And they kind of have this weird look to them, which if you look, it's kind of odd shaped. But that design is specifically so when you put it inside here like such, that you see there's a bunch in there, they don't come out so quickly. So it's not just a quick, easy, they're, they're done in 10 minutes. Um, I had a dog play with this for about 35 minutes uh, just the other day in class. Um, I like that it has the rough design here, kind of smooth on the outside. You keep the dog, kind of keeps them engaged for a really long time. Alrighty, let's go back up to FaceTime and we'll talk a little further about this. Pretty neat, I love this. Alrighty, Alrighty, so uh, as you looked in the Uppy Closey, we have, this is a very unique style, very much different than what you would think would come out of a treat dispensing toy. Alright, we've seen hundreds of treat dispensing toys on the market. I think this one actually is one of the better ones that I've seen over the years. And I'm so glad I ran into them at uh, the Global Pet Expo this year. Alright. Um, you can find these. I will put the link in the description below so you can go to their direct website to try to order them. I also got that food tray, the Slow Bowl food tray from them, and I'll be doing a review of that in the next coming weeks. So please be on the lookout for that one. Um, yeah, I like these. Uh, these are those treats I talked about they put in there. They're kind of, you can't really even see it. It's not going to focus. There we go. They're kind of raw Heidi, but I do like that really neat design that they have on there that keeps it from just falling right out of the chew toy. 
So, you know, I like they did a little innovation. Innovation is always good for the industry. It kind of moves us forward instead of just stopping in one spot. Now we're starting to see tree companies come out with their own innovative designs that work well with their particular toys, which works great for our dogs. All right, if you have any questions, comments, concerns, please go ahead, leave them in the description below or leave them in the comments below. And you know, if there's a mashup that you want me to do, I'm waiting for people to ask me to do a few mashups, so I'm kind of waiting for that. I do have one coming later this week, so be on the lookout for that one. Um, also, I do have the Neater Pet I have their, also their bowl coming, that slow bowl feeder tray, which is just phenomenal. And I can't wait for that to come out. Um, I'm waiting to get it back for one of my students who was one of my demos to do the videos with. Alrighty, so that's about it for today. Quick shorty, and I uh, hope you guys all have a great week. I'll see you.